Hello everyone, we're the Stingrays. My name is Hari and these are my teammates, Ban Kim and Lian Lian. We're from Lois Community Education Center, Kalimi Umenmer. In this video, we would like to discuss about the pinhole camera from the subject physics, which we learned in our edited lesson. The pinhole camera is the world's simplest image framing device. It is based on the principle of rectilinear propagation of light. It was invented by Maj Rousseff and Mosi in the early 5th century BC. Moreover, pinhole cameras were mostly used by artists in the Middle Ages who wanted to learn how to make a more accurate representation of a scene. Like coming from an object, passing through a pinhole forms an image. The pinhole serves as a lens. Hmm, I wonder what are the characteristics of a pinhole camera? I can help you with that. The image formed by the pinhole camera is inverted, and the image is real, as the image can be obtained on the screen. Also, the size of the pinhole, the image can, sorry, the pinhole, the image can be enlarged by increasing the distance between the pinhole and the screen. Further, the size can be diminished by increasing the distance between the pinhole and the object. One advantage of the pinhole camera is that no focusing is required for the image formation. Because there is no lens used in the pinhole camera, and the image obtained is free from optical defects like color distortion. Plus, a pinhole can also be used to safely view a solar eclipse. And one, one disadvantage of the pinhole camera is that the sharpness of the image is limited by the whole, by the size of the hole. Do you understand it? Yes, I do. Uh, do you have any other questions related to the pinhole camera? Yes, actually. Can you please explain how a pinhole camera works? Uh, I think Honey can help you with that. Sure. This is how a pinhole camera works. This is the subject, the light ray, the hole which serves as a lens, and the screen. Firstly, the light ray passes through the subject, then to the lens, which results in the image formed on the screen. This is an example of a pinhole camera. If an object is observed by the pinhole camera without any sunlight, then the image formed by the pinhole camera will be like a normal image. However, if the object is observed in the sunlight, the image formed by the pinhole camera will be inverted. Do you still have any other questions? No, I don't. Well then, this is the end of our video. Thank you for listening attentively and watching it till the end. Thank, Thank you. you.